Hi guys, Frankie PC here again working on a Windows 7 Home Edition PC. Just thought that I'd give you a, a little tutorial having been requested by some of my YouTube members uh, regarding how to do a reset on your laptop or PC's LAN card adapter uh, or wireless uh, LAN card adapter. Um, basically, the reason why this would, uh, you'd ever want to do this is, for example here, uh, if you were to get this particular page come onto your desktop uh, after you switch your PC on when it says the page can't be displayed or you're trying to go into uh, to Google or internet this is a common page which uh, you know you'll, you'll, you'll end up no doubt getting at some particular stage um, what what basically this can do is when you go on to click the fix connection problems uh, box it'll go through detecting problems and it'll try to look as it is now for any um, Problems in the registry, in the hardware, uh, device uh, devices, and uh, drivers, and obviously then it will give you a, a reason what uh, why it hasn't uh, it hasn't detected anything, or if it has, it'll actually resolve the problem. And quite often it will. It'll actually resolve the problem for you. Ask you to do a close of the icon box and maybe restart the computer to get it going. Um, the the most common thing that I've seen this particular box do here, or the diagnostics do, is it actually says that it's reset your wireless LAN card adapter, and everything is then OK. So you go to you go back to click on the internet, and away you go again. So it's done it for you automatic, automatically. But there may be a situation where this particular um, diagnostics doesn't work. Uh, you may well have a problem. Um, you know, with the system itself, and you can't get that LAN adapter to be reset, and don't know how to actually do that. So I thought I'd show you a quick, a quick way of how to do it, uh, and then obviously in the future you'll um, you'll have some idea about to do it manually yourself. Very simple to do. Um, two seconds to actually do it. And I'll just show you uh, exactly how we do it. So bottom left-hand corner, you need to click open your run box across the bottom here, so the search box, and we need to type in, in there device manager. If you just type device in, then you'll see at the top second like. Uh, Second on the, the, the top from the top of the list, it's got device manager. That's what we need to click on because it'll open the um, it'll open the device manager box up. And this is where all of the uh, drivers and all of your keyboard, your mouse, disk drives, everything is here that you want to have a look at. It's all it's all basically loaded into this uh, this fascia. All right. So what we're looking for, if you can scroll down here, we're looking for your uh, your wireless LAN adapter, and here it is. There, mine says Dell Wireless One Three Nine Zero. W LAN mini card. That's the uh, that's the the device that you know, the the di diagnostics resets. So to reset it, if you double click on it, it'll bring a properties box up here, and it says the device is working properly. Well, obviously, it's, uh, it would be a, in any case. But to do a reset of this now, uh, all that you need to basically do is to go into advanced. So sorry, into driver. Sorry about that, folks. Into driver, and then. On to uninstall, so it says to uninstall a driver, click uninstall and then press OK. Now obviously I'm not going to do this now because obviously it'll, um, it'll end up, I'll have to do a restart of the computer and unfortunately I'm not working on a, um, on a virtual box. Uh, so we've, basically you trust me on this one, so it's uninstall, which will uninstall a driver, click OK, restart the computer and the computer uh, will automatically find the new driver or find the uh, the, the, you know, the updated driver and it will also automatically install your LAN card for you and then it should, uh, it should go straight on to, uh, to your internet connection. So that's basically how you do it guys, it's as simple as that. Uh, but that's what the, as I say, the diagnostics is doing for you in the background. But I thought I'd show you uh, manually how to do it. Alright, so if you've, uh, if you haven't done any more videos like this or if there's anything particularly you're getting stuck on and you want me to, uh, to do a tutorial on it for you then I'll, uh, you know, it'll be a pleasure to do that for you. Okay guys, see you again in the future then. Thank you. Bye.